Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. This is a brand new 2022 BMW M5 competition. That's a bad man. What I have here today is a brand new system to show you for traditional washing. If you're a rinseless detailer like I am, this may not be for you. If you're interested, it will save you some time if you do traditional wash. So the system is comprised of two different products one of which is a, a wash, strip, and prep shampoo. These are currently unreleased. Um, the strip, prep, and prime are going to be, <clears throat> it's going to be yellow and smell like banana. This soap will, just like the name says, it will clean really well. It'll strip off any old wax or sealant that you have on there. And it's gonna leave behind a primer for the wash and coat shampoo, which is right here. You use them both the exact same way at the exact same dilution. This is a 32 ounce foam cannon reservoir. I put one ounce of the, the prep shampoo in here and I basically filled it, well, it's a little more than halfway, but that's all right. So in here, I generally recommend to put two ounces of the soap and then fill it up with water. But because I'm only doing this car and then I'm gonna have to empty this because I only brought one foam cannon with me and put some of the wash and coat shampoo in here, I only did half. So with that said, I'm gonna take you through how to use this new system, save yourself some time. And if you're an enthusiast, you're getting things done faster with better end results. If you're a professional or a weekend warrior where you try to make money detailing, it's gonna save you a lot of time and give the customer a huge benefit. So with that said, I've got my little water tank set up in my van. I've got my little pressure washer, 1.2 GPM. I use the Uberflex hose and then I've got my gun here. This is a uh, 40 degree tip that I like to use for rinsing, uh, pre-rinse and then rinsing off soap. But this is what I like to do is uh, first of all, I go around the car and just knock off the bulk. I'm always using deionized water. That's the best option, especially if you have to wash in direct sunlight and you're worried about water spots and or you don't wanna dry it. That's the beauty of deionized water. So. With that said, that's all that I use when I do my washes is deionized water. I use all Florida water here in Florida. They're owned by the Culligan Company. So if you've got Culligan water in your area, you should reach out and see if they can offer you a DI um, tank system so that you can have DI water as well. So the first order of business is to go around the vehicle with just water and knock what I call the bulk off of the contamination. So. Let's do that. All right, so the biggest benefit to this particular step is that you're removing the bulk of the material that's sitting on top of the paint and the wheels and that kind of stuff. And it's gonna help the soaps to basically better adhere to the actual surface that you're applying it to, uh, and then do a better job of cleaning and removing the rest of the dirt and grime and then with the wash and coat, that will be that one adding protection and being able to bond straight to the, to the surface you're dealing with. So now I've got the whole vehicle rinsed down, the bulk is knocked off, take your nozzle off, put your foam cannon on your gun, then you're going to just foam the entire vehicle for step two.
right, step two is to use the uh, prep. Now, you're gonna let that dwell for about, I don't know, 30 seconds, let the cleaners do its job and that kind of thing. Um, some of the suds, um, this particular soap isn't going to be the most foamy, but it definitely is plenty of, of foam for it to go on, do its thing, for you to wash it off, and then you're good to go. So the next step is just use plain water to wash. Now you can do the Gary Dean wash method with multiple towels or multiple wash media in a bucket. Um, I am not going to do that. Most people don't know what a swirl mark is, nor do they care. Um, it is your higher end enthusiast that really cares about that stuff. Um, while I do everything I can to take as much care as possible to not swirl a vehicle up, at the same time, I make money doing this. So I've got to make sure that um, my pricing is in line with the service that they're getting and what they want. And so in doing that, sometimes there isn't enough time for a professional detailer to take all the time and do a traditional wash for very little money. You, you just, or I should say, do a traditional wash for a lot more money than the customer's used to paying for because you got to take all that extra time. So what I do is I will use a safe wash sponge, which you can find on detailjuice.com in the miscellaneous category. Uh, it's a soft sponge that won't scratch on its own. You have to make it do it. Um, and so I start from top to bottom, just washing the vehicle with the one towel uh, or the one wash media, dip it in, in the bucket and go into town. Now, this is probably not what you'll love to see but this is how professional detailers save time and keep rolling. So with that said, And just to be perfectly clear, I do care about swirl marks and I care that my customers potentially could see them and not like them. So I do everything I can to make sure that I don't put in more swirls than I have to. And swirls are inevitable. Things and particles are flying around all the time. They can fly on your paint, they can fly in the bucket, they can get on the mitt, doesn't matter. Particulates are everywhere and swirls are potentially going to happen every single time you wash. All you can do is the best that you can. And so with my customers, I don't do a maintenance service. I don't have a service or even a package on detailjuice.com where I come out to your house and I do the high-end maintenance with the, you know, with the Gary Dean wash method, multiple towels, and doing all that extra stuff. There's no package for that. However, I will do that if the, the customer wants me to maintain the coating I've applied or even the polishing that I've done. I have no problem doing that. I have to charge a little extra time in there to get it done properly. So I will do that service, but I'm not in the maintenance business. I'm in the business to do the higher end details, corrections, and coatings. That's what I do. 
I also, when I do my coatings for my own detailing business, Gary Dean Detailing, um, I offer the maintenance products, the soap, for free. So I give you the soap to do your own maintenance, if that makes any sense, because I'm not in the maintenance business. So with that said, I'm going to continue washing this thing, and I'll bring you back for the next step. All right, so I have gone ahead and washed the whole vehicle, all the wheels and everything. Now, it's time to hose it off, but once you've hosed off the wash and prep shampoo after you've done your wash, that is the time to clay bar if you need to. Now, I've gone around this vehicle already with a, a, a hand inside a plastic bag and run it over the paint very little contamination on this one because I didn't have the agreement with the customer to do this job on the level that I'm doing it for this video. He's getting this job for free, but I'm actually adding incredible value by doing this brand new system for him. So that's kind of where we're at. So I'm not going to clay the vehicle. I'm just going to rinse and go to the next step in the process uh with the soaps now the clay bar portion of this where you'd be doing right after you rinse off the first wash that's very important when you clay bar you're removing the contaminants that are bonded to the paint that don't come off in the wash and to feel whether or not you have contamination like i mentioned get a ziploc bag put your hand in it and rub it across clean dry paint so wash the vehicle dry it and then check for contamination if you feel all the grit on your fingertips, then it's time to clay bar the vehicle, which I have other videos on. So now, after this rinse I'm about to do, then you'd go into clay bar, but for the sake of this video and time, we're gonna skip the clay bar step and go straight into the wash and coat step. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this, then we'll be back with the uh, wash and coat shampoo step. All right guys, as I mentioned in the last clip, after you've rinsed, after your clean and prep wash, that's the time to clay bar the vehicle. I am not going to show you that today, but this right now is the time to do that. You can use either water as your lube, or what I recommend is to use the original Infinite Use Detail Juice, uh, mixed up and diluted, spray it on the surface, use the clay bar, then you're gonna wipe everything down just that you've put there to make sure there's no clay bar residue on anything. Then you're gonna mix up your foam cannon like I have here. I have um, one ounce of the wash and coat shampoo and then I filled it halfway up with water. So we're gonna go ahead at this point, you can leave the residual water on the car after you've wiped off all your clay bar residue and the residue from the infinite use detail juice or your clay lubricant or whatever, all you literally have to do now to protect this vehicle is spray this foam right on the vehicle on every surface, let it sit and dwell for about 30 seconds. Then you're just gonna rinse it off and you're done. <laughs> Check this out, all right. Time to, uh, well, got to untwist your hose. So here we go. This is the protection portion. There's no washing. You spray it on, you let it dwell, you rinse it off. Nothing more. That's it. I use a little bit more than half of that. So you can get four vehicles out of each soap uh, with only two ounces of, of the soaps. So basically each 32 ounce reservoir you fill up, you can foam a, a regular size car or a little bigger like this one. Um, you could do four cars with that. So now 
we wait 20, 30, 40 seconds. Um, I would try, I guess the best rule of thumb is you could put a, a time limit on it, but the problem with that is every environment's different, every temperature is different. Like right now, it's about 90 degrees out here. I'm in Tampa, well, right now, I, you know, yeah, I am in Tampa, Florida right now. But um, the car is in the shade, so it's going to take a little bit more time to start drying up. And you don't want it to dry, but what you want is for the water, which is the carrier in all this, you want the water to start evaporating where it's going to leave the ceramic acrylics with graphene blend, the triple trifecta technology blend on the surface. And because that water is evaporating, you're leaving all the good stuff behind that can bond to the paint. There is a kind of a penetrant involved here in the wash and coat shampoo. It's designed to cross link into the pores and harden in there and then give you a really slick, nice shell on the outside of great protection. Um, I've been using this system for about eight months, well, no, about nine months now, and all of the original cars, there are 11 of them that I've been messing with and, and making sure that this system works great before I ever try to pitch it to you, which is what this video is about. Um, those are doing really, really well. I've been maintaining them with the perfect soap from my Infinite lineup, which is just a great maintenance soap, has no gloss enhancers, nothing in it. All it is is a nice pH neutral, very sudsy, great soap to use for maintenance. It's not gonna add anything or take anything away from the paint, which is why I love it, and that's what it's for. So I maintain those 11 cars with that soap just to test the protection and we're in excess now of eight months with no problem solid beading really tight it'll sheet when everything pulls up it'll roll right off you can tell that these things are protected the gloss from the ceramic acrylics and graphene blend it's insane so now we've given this plenty of time to do its thing to start to dry a little bit you can see how even the application is now it's time to rinse it off so here we go. Look at that water behavior. <laughs> never realized coating wheels could be so easy did you and just like that with just a rinse after you foam this stuff on it's all protected how easy is that you literally spray this stuff on let it dwell for around 30 seconds then you rinse it off everything's coated the stuff bonds really well it lasts a very long time especially when you use the prep shampoo first because it's leaving behind that uh, prep solution and uh, when you just spray this stuff on all you've got to do like I mentioned is let it dwell rinse it off you're good to go now I use deionized water the benefit here is I don't have to dry this car now I can literally let it sit in the Sun and dry completely with no water spots which is exactly what I'm gonna do um, I will open the doors and wipe the door jams out, but the cool part about the ionized water is you're saving all your drying time. All I've literally got to do now is wipe out the door jams and dress the tires. I don't know why I did that, but that's what I got to do. Dress the tires. That's how we do it. So these two soaps are amazing. I do want to add 
First of all, this is a 2021, not a 2022. I apologize, I thought he told me 22, this is a 21. Um, but beyond that, um, it's, it's just so easy, guys. Three different steps, wash, clay bar, and then coat. That's it. This is done. We have no problem saying that this product should last you over a year, but I'm going to give it a one year rating uh, here in Florida. We're already at eight months in plus on those 11 vehicles. And well, there's no reason why they shouldn't last four more months. Um, I will give you an update on them, but I don't have a problem saying that we're going to have a year plus out of this product because of my experience already. It's awesome. And based on the what's in it, I know that we should get even longer than that. But you got to have levels for things. And this is so easy. It's just stupid easy. I'm not sure why anybody wouldn't do this. But that's the two. That's the two shampoos. Uh, the formulas are finalized. They will not change. I recently did a promo on the web on well, through Gary Dean's Details Use Nation, it's a group on Facebook, uh, that I talk about only, well, we in the group, we talk about only my products, my processes, and what I've got going on. Last week, I did a promo on the wash and coat shampoo. The formula was not finalized yet on the prep shampoo, which it now is done. Um, these two work together. You can use this if you want to use another protective product. And yes, it will prep. It will do all of the cool things that it's supposed to do. But it's th this was designed to be used with this. These two are two peas in a pod. Those are what you need if you want to do what I just did in very little time. I literally washed and coated this vehicle in about 45 minutes. Come on. Come on now. You know that's fast. That's awesome. And not because I'm super fast. Well, we're pretty efficient over here, I like to say. Uh, but anybody could do it. It's not difficult. This is not rocket science. It's detailing. I mean, we're not saving the world here. We're just cleaning vehicles and boats and that kind of thing. So um, formulas are fi finalized. I will be offering them in the one system. Uh, it's a great, great system. I highly recommend you give it a shot. Um, of course, I could tell you anything I want. My name's on the bottle. Well, not these, well, I guess it is on the bottle. <laughs> um, but honestly, guys, I only push products your way that we develop that are going to save you time and money. If you look at using this system, you're gonna spend about $3 per car actually less than that but i'm giving you a, a, a dollar amount that we can both agree on you're going to spend about three bucks per car using both of these for the package that i just showed you where i would use this soap to clean and prep i would use the clay bar to clay bar and then this wash and coat shampoo to do the prote protection with all the traditional wash and all of that I charge $150 for that service. Yes, it does include a basic interior. So I vacuum everything out, wipe it down, lightly hit the windows, and then I'll wipe out the door jams and dress the tires. That's it. $150 is what I, I get for this package. Gives you gives the customer over a year of protection, subject, subjectively, at, at this point, eight months. Who cares, right? Eight months is still solid longevity for protection. but. When you see the gloss that you get from this stuff after it cures in 24 hours, it's insane. Um, but I can tell you whatever I want. I need you guys to try these products and let me know how you like them. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm really excited to release these formulas. They're brand spanking new. Uh, we went back to the drawing board and created this brand new system. But I think this is going to be a game changer, guys, just for those people who like traditional washing. If you like rinseless, these will not help you at all. Uh, so. Give them a shot. Uh, check out my group, Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. Get in there. If you want to be a part of something bigger than detailing, we'll talk to you about all our products and everything we've got going on. Get in there. You can talk to other people besides just me that use my products and get other non-biased opinions, I guess, uh, and go from there. 
but I'm really excited about these. It's gonna really change the way we detail. I actually put this system together for a car wash locally, and I have pitched it to three other car washes who just cannot wait to get it. So I'm gonna send it to the world. So that's where we're at. Check out detailjuice.com for all your product needs. Official release for this system is going to be July 1st, 2021. So July 1st, 2021, I'll have the official labels. Um, they will be on the website. It's gonna be great, guys. I'm super, super excited to launch these products. Let me know if you need me. 813-846-4406 is my cell. No other product line manufacturer on the face of the planet gives out his personal cell phone number. I do that because I care about you. This is added value beyond the concentrate concentrates I sell. I don't like shipping water. I'm all about these concentrates. So you get awesome money. Yes, the price tag is higher to get in, but when you start doing your simple math to figure out how much product you're using per vehicle out of these concentrates, you realize no other product line manufacturer on the planet has the value that mine does. So let me know if you need me. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a wonderful day.